Whiskey. I've had that. I need something better. Oh, I think I got what you need. That's pretty good. I believe I have another shot. Got anything to eat around here? Sure do. Well, here you go, honey. Only the finest. Jack Daniels. This is my kind of place. In honor of the 25th anniversary of the Jack Daniels World Invitational Barbecue. And this Jack is going home to the Welcome to the Jack. That's barbecue. Things are really heating up here in Lynchburg, Tennessee. It's the 25th annual barbecue contest of the world. It's the Jack. This is a pretty elite group. The best of the best. We're from uh, Roland, Arkansas, which is right outside of Little Rock. Um, we were the 1995 Jack Daniels World Champion, so we are super, super excited to be invited back and be in the winner's circle. Um, we, uh, we cooked in 95 as novices. We were, it was our rookie year and we came down here and won it. And uh, got the bug again and started cooking again. So uh, we cook in a couple of competitions a year, but primarily what we do is it comes into play with the name of our team. We'll pick who we feed the need. We do mostly charity events. We go out and cook. If we win contests, the money that we win, we donate to a local charity, or we go and cook more food and feed the homeless a couple times a month. So we just do this now for fun more than the competition. So this is, we came back because we got to win the Super Bowl once, want to come back and hopefully try to win it again, but uh, we love it. We made this trip 11 years, told my wife, I said, if I could ever win Jack, I said, I'd be done, I'd be done. In 97, we won American Royal in Kansas City, and in 98, we won Jack, and I said, hey, there's nothing left, we're there. And so we retired, they called us about three months ago and asked us if we would be interested in coming back and doing this. And, We've been floating since. <laughs> Just love it. So what would it mean if you win today? <laughs> like I say, you probably see a fat boy cry. <laughs> My name is Josh and I'm with We Willies. We are from uh, Minnesota and we would love to win the Jack today because it's been, what, 13 years now since we won it last. And it'd be a privilege just to be able to come back and, and be around all these great people and to be able to, to, to prove that we still have it. Paul Kirk, known as Kansas City Baron of Barbecue. Uh, we were the first winners. There were only 30 teams, uh, so it's grown leaps and bounds. To be the winner, uh, I don't really know if I can put it in words because uh, it, it's one of those things that, wow. And to come back and do this again, it's more than wow. Team Kansas City it started from a vision that we had Paul, myself, and Chef and Kieran Putman to put our talents together collectively and go represent the Kansas City Barbecue Society, the, the city of Kansas City, and the barbecue fanatics of Kansas City in barbecue events outside the United States primarily. I actually remember when we went to deliver, to give the trophy to the mayor, the mayor of Kansas City, we gave our awards to the mayor of Kansas City, and and all of a sudden, here come an invitation, come to Jack Daniels. 
until three weeks ago. <laughs> that Paul gives me a call and say, hey, Comandante. I say, yes, Ben. He say, guess what? I say, what? Well, Jack Daniels called. It's the 25th anniversary, and uh, we're putting the team back together. <laughs> Last year we was here and uh, get a first place in cooking from homeland. So uh, we're going to do it again. We went to Morocco uh, to compete in the WBQA competition. Uh, it's a, a championship. And when we came to Morocco, uh, we never get our grills. They were taken in, uh, in custom and were in Casablanca. Yeah. And um, the guy who have arranged it took away with all the money. And uh, someone else have to take over, so we get no meat. And then we borrowed uh, three uh, off-site smokers. They took one from us because some others needed it. And we get the meat very late, late yeah. at night. And we took down at three o'clock in the night. Yes. Yes, started up and said to each other, we have to deliver everything, then we can't do anymore. We didn't know those smokers. But when the day was over... Then we're going to be grand camping. And, fir so. and, first, and first place in lamb ribs. And third in chicken, chicken, yes, chicken, yes. And there were no, there were no pig in that competition because it, uh, it's a Muslim country. So every everything oh, is uh, lamb. lamb instead of pig. So it was very funny for us, but we, it was an adventure. Yes, a great yes. adventure. We survived Morocco. <laughs> Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Jack. jack. Uh, this is actually our first time at the Jack. Barbecuing is very much. Uh, you make a lot of friends doing it. I mean, if, if somebody's ever asking about, you know, should they get into competitive barbecue, it's always yes. It's more like family. It's the family that you want to go and see rather than the family you have to go and yeah, see. That's, well, that, that's my point of view on it anyway. I mean, competing at the Jack is... Welcome to Jack Daniels. <laughs> I, love, I love hanging out with my British friends yeah. in Kansas City. Yeah, in Kansas. Kansas. You guys are champions. Now, Welcome. is this poisonous? Are you trying to kill me? Yeah, or is exactly. this okay? You're kidding. I'm trying to kill him. You saw it Yeah, but it's poison to me. He knows. He's wise. He's onto us. That's what barbecue's all about. It's all about friends, family, food. And a lot of Jack Daniels. Yeah. <laughs> From the UK, welcome to the Jack. And to all the Jack viewers, Rocky! <laughs> well, we're at Jack, uh, we're invited, as everybody is, and that's because we won the uh, Tony Sono uh, competition in Holland. And our first time at the Jack, and well, it's amazing. It's really amazing. It's a dream came true. Yeah, that's how you can say it. Everything we see on television, it's America, it's barbecuing. In Holland, they, uh, yeah, they tell us, we are crazy people. <laughs> what are you going to do in the States to barbecue? You are crazy. We drive, uh, it's 10,000 kilometers, 6,000 miles from home, only to do a barbecue. They That's told okay. us, you are stupid. But when we came here, everybody likes it. Everybody says, hi, good, and uh, we see you at the Jack. And, uh, that's just, great. Just let's say we're happy stupid yeah. at the moment. So we don't care to be stupid. Yeah. We feel welcome. Absolutely. Yeah. From the Netherlands, welcome, welcome to, to the Jack. Jack. We're Thomas and Jenny from Gothenburg, um, west coast in Sweden. We live barbecue and um, we wanted to try the real deal and want to be competing once in the motherland of barbecue. So we're here. Infected by the barbecue virus on a visit in America and we wanted to try that. So we started a couple of years ago uh, to cook in the American way and people love it, our guests love it, so we started a catering company and uh, through that we started competing. We're competing all over Europe, uh, even in Africa and now we're here, so having a good time. In Sweden we also have some good stuff for you, but we redefined for for the barbecue, so we will do some planked, uh, cedar planked salmon, some wild salmon for the homeland cooking, and we hope to get the uh, judges on our side. 
Welcome, Welcome to, to the Jack, Jack. Flaming Pig, Pig Barbecue, Barbecue Sweden. Sweden. You can find us on www.flamingpigbarbecue.com. Hello, my name is René. I'm from Estonia. Uh, we have uh, Estonian barbecue team here. Uh, we are cooking all the competition entries. Uh, pork, beef, uh, ribs, uh, chicken. Hi, I'm Tarvo. We are from Estonia. We are Estonian barbecue team. And our uh, homeland special today is uh, really big beans with uh, really, really good uh, barbecue sauce. We boil them for uh, two hours. And then we have uh, like uh, meat screws. Uh, we put uh, pork tenderloin, we marinated it uh, in teriyaki sauce and we wrapped it on bacon. So it will be best homeland ever. Hi there guys, yeah, so we team Chesson Yama Barbecue. We're from South Africa. Barbecuing is very, very unique in South Africa, or, or should I say, uh, it's not very popular and it's fairly unknown. We're very big on brying, so everybody knows about brying. Um, but we figured we'd give this barbecue thing a, a try. Brying is what we call barbecuing, or what you guys call grilling, actually. So we've got the skills, we've got the know, we just don't do it your way yet. So we, we came here to, to, to learn firstly, but I think we've practiced enough to give you guys a go. Everyone's going to be a close second. So our homeland dish, this is a compilation, it's really a team effort there. We had a big brainstorm, we actually had a boot camp for four days. Um, so everyone had the inputs um, to decide what is going to be, what we want to show the people. Yeah, there's so many traditional South African, South African foods. I mean, we actually did have a, a tough choice to decide on a single item. So what we decided to do was a, a couple of samples of everything. Yes. So what we showed you now now is the, uh, what we like to call the Mandela microwave. It is a three-legged pot and we make poiki course in it. And that is really as South African as you're going to get. Yes, I mean, we're very fortunate. Uh, bringing 10 guys from South Africa obviously cost a lot of money. And it was made possible by two real key uh, sponsors of ours, Chesson Yama, who's a fast food braai company in South Africa. Hi there, my name is uh, Wiseman. My first name is Tamsanga Vilagazi. That's a Zulu name. Uh, I'm from South Africa. Uh, I got into this by, of course, being a part of the company that's sponsoring. That's Chesanyama. So we're sponsoring the guys and uh, that's how I got here. And our good friend here, old Jimmy from Jimmy Sauces. So Jimmy Sauce is to sauce what Jack Daniels is to whiskey. And that's Jimmy. Thank you. <laughs> My sauce is not uh, American style. We don't, I don't use smoke. Uh, I, it, I find it's very overpowering onto, onto your meat. And uh, yes, yeah, so I'm sure in the next year or so we'll be in, in America, taking over America. And, and <laughs> you haven't told us what the secret ingredient is yet. Do you want to tell them perhaps? Love. No, <laughs> that's his standard answer. Well, it's a good one. Thanks, Jimmy. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, guys, you're going to learn how to say, how y'all doing? Okay. <laughs> Alright, so here we go. How? How? Y'all? Y'all? Doing? Doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Good job! Oh, yeah. <laughs> we can speak American. <laughs> you can speak American. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Yeah, you gotta practice your how y'all. How y'all? How y'all? I sound like Eli Eli Eliza Doolittle. Y'all. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta, you gotta, you gotta. Hi, y'all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How y'all doing? Yeah. <laughs> now, here's your next thing. Uh -huh. See y'all later. See, See y'all later. All right. See y'all later. See y'all later. See y'all later. <laughs> and then there's one more. Okay, yeah. Y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs> <laughs> try that, try that. Y'all come, come back, back now. now. Yeah, yeah. Y'all yeah. yeah. come, come back, back now. Yeah. yeah. Y'all come <laughs> back <laughs> now. Yeah. Oh, we flew it. Welcome to the deck. deck.
Welcome to the Jack. We are big supporters of competition barbecue. Of course, everything we do is not just competition. That's actually, when you look at where we sell our wood in about 50,000 retail outlets nationwide, a very small percentage of that goes to competition barbecuers. But what you have with competition is people practicing their passion, refining their craft, and every single day working at, getting, at becoming better at what they do. And in this case, it's barbecue. Uh, so whether you're competing at, at driving cars and making them faster like NASCAR would, or uh, you're practicing something to make it better and better. That's what your competition guys are doing every single day. for y'all's support for making every Jack Daniels barbecue better than the one before. And thank you for making the 25th a very memorable one for me. Thank y'all so much.
the 25th anniversary of the Jack Daniels World Invitational Barbecue. And this check is going home to Cool Smith. I call barbecue jack. <laughs> 